So the Buesa Arena is the backdrop as Basconia Vittoria Gasteiz welcome Fenerbahce back to Istanbul for round 12 action. The players finished their pre-game routines and the sellout crowd ramped up the decibels, unaware they were about to witness a regular season classic. Fenerbahce will be looking to silence this crowd as quickly as possible. And that's precisely what they did as the guests powered their way through a dominant first period. Goes up strong and the baseline jam in a crowd of Basconia defenders. Palatas has got to let it go and he rattles home the three-pointer. Three minutes into the second quarter and Fenerbahce would extend their lead to 15. Deep into the shot clock, Nigel Hay Davis got to pull the trigger and he lands it. With Basconia in dire need of inspiration, Marcus Howard answered the call. Catching of the shooter and connecting from downtown. Roaring contact and getting the field goal to fall. Terrific touch. Marcus Howard clobbered on the three-pointer, but he makes no mistake. The American sharpshooter gunned down the deficit before his backcourt partner added the exclamation mark. The floater is short, but thrown down with tremendous force from Cody Miller-McIntyre. The whole of period three was played within a five-point margin. Two European heavyweights trading punch for punch. Basconia held a slender lead for much of the final quarter, but Fenerbahce refused to stay down. They go back to Goodrich, deep three-pointer. Big bucket from downtown. We are deadlocked, 77 points apiece. Shot clock in the red, deflected by Cody Miller-McIntyre. Fenerbahce have got to pull the trigger, they get it away to beat the shot clock. And how about that for boys under pressure? Down two with 14 seconds left in the game, there was only going to be one man with the ball in his hands. The question, could Fenerbahce stop him? Marcus Howard, pull up three, fouled in the act of shooting. A dramatic three-point bomb proved to be the final score of the game. Marcus Howard putting the cape around his shoulders and the team on his back once again. A night for the history books, but a rivalry that resumes in round 27 as the pair meet again in Istanbul in a game with major playoff implications.